Okay, everyone, we are back. We are about to go look for Tama. We don't know where she ran off to after the craziness happened. So, let's go see what she is up to. I know she was very upset. Uh, she seems to know about who the, uh, those guys are, the, the, the trio. They called them, was it the circle or something? The Order of the Circle. My goodness. What's with these especially long faces? Oh, I'm glad you're here. Seraphie, could you go get Tama for us? You want Tama? Funny you ask. She's been floating around like a terrified marshmallow ever since she got back. Let the pretty pixie handle this. Hey! Tama. Huh? Tama. Tommy Tom, answer me. Oh, how dare you ignore me, you puny fluff butt! I am going to wash! You're so good! Okay. I brought Tama like you asked. Oh, Seraphie, one the day I will destroy you. Tama, can we talk? We just really, really need to know what happened. <sighs> Thanks for the reminding me. This is no time to go the Gaga. Those Cogna the Night Summoners seriously bad the news. Cogna? No way. Yes, the way, and we have to stop them. A uh, timeout. Before we go any further, Tama, what's a Cogna? They're horrible, bad things completely beyond the description! Well, uh, maybe you should try anyway? A Cogna are living machines that thrive on destruction. They have laid more worlds to waste than there are stars in the sky. And that's not a poetic exaggeration. What? But that's nuts! They're almost a, like a disease. It's not that they're all strong, it's that they never the stop growing in number. Once they manage to invade a world, no one can stop them the ever, not even in a crow herself. Then what about the knights? Are they like Cogna Masters or something? Something the else. They call themselves the X-9 Knights. They're a horrible order who the wander from the world to world and leave chaos in their wake. Which the leads to the question, why, I suppose. Yeah. But, if they were the Order of the Circle, then I think I know the why. Whoa. Did you say the Order of the Circle? I'm afraid the so. Yes, no, please Bad news. Man, the Seraphy have a history with them that goes back more years than I know how to the count. There are arch, 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 arch nemeses, to put it politely. Bummer. So that's who is pulling the strings. But that means they won't rest until... Until the every last world is destroyed. They're filled to the gills with ill the will. I'm still not sure I get it. But basically you're saying grimoires and hot water. Is that the idea? The water's so hot it's almost the steaming. And if you think it will end with just the grimoire, then you've got another thing the coming. Is Ninewood Hills in danger too? That wouldn't even be the tip of the iceberg. Oh, no. No, no, no. We're not talking just one or two of the worlds. You see, we're the part of a whole Googleplex of worlds. A Googleplex? What is that, like a thousand? Dude! Actually, a Googleplex is ten. To the tenth, to the hundredth power. A MILLION WORLDS?! <laughs> we can work on your math skills some other time. I need to get one thing straight. The reason those things got into Grimoire... It's our fault, isn't it? Huh? Um... The maybe, I think... Yes. So, basically, we've put Grimoire and other worlds in terrible danger. Yeah, oops. No. No, that can't be true. It is. We messed up. Those guys in the armor, they used us. They invented a false prophecy and tricked us 
into opening the Ultima Gate. Mom was just the bait. <sighs> Would you cut it out? No way, dude. Hey, hang on. Anna Crow is the one who said to collect mirages to find our family. If she hadn't let us on, then... Maybe... she's... one of them. No way! Absent the positively no way! Huh? Oh, well, yeah, after all, Anna Crow would never, ever lie. All right, then. I guess I'll let it go. <sighs> so, like, why'd they pick us? How come we were even able to do something like that? I was... the hoping you would know. Um, if you're going to ask the someone, you should ask your big sister. You might... be right. Let's return to Balam Garden and go talk to Alwyn. <sighs> Lon? Huh? Uh, oh! Yeah, I guess she might be awake. He was so excited this whole trip, and it ended up being bad. Oh, poor Lon. But yeah. Uh, and I'm confused about them calling um, her their sister, because in that little flashback it said that we're like sisters, not that she is the sister. So I'm confused about their relationship. <laughs> But that's okay. Let's head back to Balam Garden and figure out... Oh, we can't go to Saronia. We could go to Nibelheim, but... Huh. I wonder why... Oh well. We'll find out, I'm sure. Sorry. Can we go to the infirmary yet? Excuse I us. don't need your help at the moment. I'm sorry. Do -do -do. Sorry, but Quistus made it very clear that I can't let you pass this point. She's up here, not the infirmary. Hey there, Alwyn. Tell me one thing. Your past. Do you remember any of it? No. Not really. Afraid not. Right. Of course. If you did remember, there's no way you would be talking to me. But... I do remember you're my sister, Wen. She does. But I don't. So then... What will you do to me this time? Do to you? But when those knights were holding you prisoner! Stop. Huh? I don't know you anymore, so don't call me that. But when? Enough! Okay... I was a prisoner for a very long time. But it wasn't the knights. Well, who then? You ought to know. And why should I bother to help you? Figure out the obvious. You have to remember. For Lady Luce. Our mom? Is she here? Is she still alive? Yes. They're here. Lady Luce and Lord Rorik. Rorik? Her <gasps> dad? Then mom and dad are both okay? Where are they? But you know that too. Where they are. What they're doing. We do? Are you sure? Alwyn. Are you one of the bad guys? Me? One of them? You must be joking! But... You went around in a mask tricking us. Enough. Say no more. 
I just don't want to hear it. <laughs> Siren! Oh, hey! Hello! Wait! You can't go! We still have so many questions! You bring nothing to this world but pain! And chaos! Leave now! Go back home! And never wake from your sleep again! Your mother and father... I'll save them. Uh, gosh, bomb it. What the honk is her problem? She didn't tell us anything. No, but you heard what she said about mom and dad. They need to be saved. Huh? Oh, yeah. I guess she did. Okay, but what do they need saving from? And does saving I don't mean know. killing them? Hey, what's going on? Did you see that mirage? Where's Alan? <sighs> that explains what happened. But then, what are you two going to do now? I'm not sure. I know, this may sound a little selfish, but... If you don't mind, maybe you could help us fight off the Cogna that have appeared across Grimmoor. Yes. We, we need more manpower. As much as we can get. Sure. Huh? Whether we were tricked or not, we're still the ones who brought them here. We have to fix this. As long as we have the power to do it. That's right, Lon. Yeah, you're right. Besides, <sighs> helping the League out with operations means gathering mirages and getting stronger. If Seraphie and Tom are right, and we can trust what Enicro told us, then we ought to keep going. Let's collect mirages, and find our family. <sighs> yeah. Great. Okay then, the airship. We'll let you borrow it. The skies are yours. Go on out there and help wherever you can. We have an airship. Oh, we can now use Yunus. And Terra. Awesome. It's good that we're helping the League out, but remember, we need to round up more mirages. Tama, these Cogna things, can you tell us more about them? They look powerful. Like mirages, some of the Cogna are strong and some not so the much. Then again, the tough ones are really the really the tough. In fact, some of the Cogna have such powerful defenses that regular attacks that won't even leave a scratch on them. Dude, what? How are we supposed to stop them, then? Remember, we're not the only ones out there fighting. There's Cloud, Squall, Lightning. We're all gonna have to learn to help each other out. Right. Good point. Chapter 21. Chaos in Grimoire. Okay. So where are we supposed to start? Well... If we can track down Cloud, Squall, and Lightning, they could probably use a little help with the Cogna. Right, but where are they? Oh, we need more intel! Oh, for that the kind of stuff, you should definitely consult with Seraphie. Hang on while I go in to get her! Yeah, hi. So I suppose you're gonna make me break out the old rumor radar for you. Rumor radar? Oh, that's my secret power, hun. It lets me instantly snap up every bit of gossip within my threshold. In a teensy world like this, that basically only amounts to everything. Whoa, now that's <laughs> cool! Huh? Is it cool? Yes. Well, I'm no expert, but I'd say it is. Woo-hoo! I thought I'd never be one of those cool pixies. Well, you'd be the cooler if you picked up facts instead of rumors. Thanks for that reminder. Uh, well, so do you mind trying it? Yeah, sure. I guess I'll start us out by narrowing down the search to those Cogna we're after. Sound good? Yeah. 
Going back to what they said, though, about their parents, that's the one thing that I'm worried about here because so often in games, yeah, the quote-unquote saving people kind of ultimately ends up with being, um, killing them. So, hopefully Here's that won't the happen. Latest. Around Cornelia, did you hear? A strange four-legged machine is closing in on Cornelia. The Warrior of Light and that tough-looking lady with the pink hair were talking about some kind of plan to keep the threat at bay. But what if it doesn't work? I can hardly sleep at night. There you have it. Here's the latest. Around Nibelheim, get a load of this. Some creepy... Some kind of creepy machine is tearing the landscape up right outside of Nibelheim. Soldiers out there are trying to take it down, but it looks like they're barely made a dent in the thing. Not even that guy with the big sword and the young lady in the cowboy hat have been able to stop it. Okay. There you have it. Here's the latest. Around Figaro. I don't know where they came from, but a bunch of strange machines have taken over the desert. One of our merchants would have died if King Edgar and the castle guard hadn't come to the rescue. Figaro is putting up a good fight, but there are just so many. If only we knew what was controlling them. There you have it. Here's the latest. Around Tome Town, you'll never believe it. There's been another sighting of that spooking, what spooking, spooky runaway train. Where does it come from? Where does it go? I'm too scared to set foot outside my door. Sid and Celis have been racking their brains trying to figure out what makes it tick. But if they don't stop it soon, I think Tome Town might up end up going Tome Down. There you have it. And the save. Here's the latest. Where did that flying mechanical monstrosity come from? It's been dive-bombing people left and right. My goodness, I just hope it moves on soon and leaves Besaid alone. How are we supposed to fight off something we can't even reach? Huh, okay. So, like, things are basically terrible everywhere? Yes. That's a problem. We can't be in all of those places at once. Time! I command you to stop! Okay, can we just build a time machine or something? Inside Ninewood Hills, you do realize that time is essentially stopped? Oh, wait! That girl behind the door in Ninewood Hills, couldn't she help us reach everyone? Huh? You're right! Inside her room, we can skip around to any point in time that we want! I see... And I can now to board the, the airship, airship, all you have to do is press the button shown on the world map! Airship! It's time to take to the skies! While the area map is open, you can open up the world map by a single press of the square button. You can still choose your destination from a list, but chances are there's something else you've been dying to do. Why not take the helm and give your airship a spin? Who knows, you might even discover new mirages. Really? Oh my god. That is the pause button. Gates are nice! But there's nothing like taking to the skies and the watching the world rush by! Yeah! It's like the start of a new adventure! <laughs> I know, it's exciting! But don't forget that if we want to help everyone, we have to use that door in Ninewood Hills. Don't worry about it, sis. We know the clock's ticking. Yes, but there are some things that are just more important first. Like... You know, flying around in an airship. Really are. I see a merc rift over there. 
That's crazy. Am I gonna get myself killed if I hit this thing? have fun with that later. Let's go talk to the girl in the little door. I have done some of her quests. They are um, interesting, but let me save real quick. They were always just some you know, like side mission-y, you know, fun stuff to do before, so... Welcome to the rift between dreams and time. What now? Well, first... Which champion would you... I would like to... Wake up these guys. What now? And... See you... Yes, I'll see you soon. Thank you. Um, let me see... I have now used her, so... Ooh, that's nice. I like it. Neutral magical damage. And, uh... You know, um, I'm going to, to be safe. I'll use... Shelk. Do okay, you mind yes. if I take a I might if you take now? a nap. We're, we're a little bit uh, busy now. Whose soul will you touch? Ah. We, we do have new ones here now, but I and I have plenty of Arma gems. So let's start out with Cornelia. Well, apparently, Tome Town has three instead of four stars, but I want to start at Cornelia. Well, that's terrifying. That hits us head on. I'll just have to hold them off here. Good luck. Lightning, Aiko, and my Princess Sarah. Well, that was cutting it close. Lucky for us, it isn't the sharpest tool in the shed, huh? Thank you for coming, Aiko. Your journey here must have been long and risky. Huh? Aww. It really wasn't that big of a deal. I'm just happy I could be of service. And besides, the only job I have is to flip the switch, so to speak. It's called the Loot of Ragnarok, isn't it? Lightning's assessment was spot on. The loot is like Big Bridge. It's an Eidolon that's entered into a deep sleep. I'm amazed you never realized what you had. Yeah, no kidding. But... If I didn't know about it, how could you? We have a giant sword on top of our castle. Cornelia's history goes back a long way. From what I understand, our first king was a summoner. 
I think it's safe to say there's no doubt about it now. Well, whatever the case, our new friend will need lots of magic to bust through that Cognus armored shell. Yes, but lightning will come through for us. Gotta hurry before that thing gets off another shot. Every second counts. Oh! Oh my gosh! Oh no, not a timed event! Oh no! Circle is fire. X is ice. Triangle for electric. Oh goodness. Okay. Gotta hurry before that thing gets off another shot. Every second counts. Oh goodness, it's not. See what it is I'm attacking sometimes. <laughs> I thought for certain the youngsters had returned. Now who might you be? Most people call me Lightning. And that's just what I have to be right now. Sorry, but I need to do this fast. I know what you've come for. Is this it? Yeah. Thanks for not making this hard. Did you smack him around, or did you ask nicely? I'm confused. I'm very, very confused. Good evening. What now? Whose soul will you... Okay. So we did Cornelia. Uh, let's go ahead and, uh, do Cornelia part two. Might as well be consistent. Creepy robot spider. Um, hey guys! That thing is looking right at us this time! What do we do? Eiko! Judgment staff now. K, rise and shine. Loot of Ragnarok awaken. All right. That's what I've been waiting for. It's over, Cogna! I was not prepared, though. Should have been. Whoa! I wish I had a super beam like that. What would you even do with it if you had one? Now, come on. We have to stop this thing before it goes any further. Got it. Ah! Ah! Lightning, which I don't think I even have. 
have right now. Yep, very weak to lightning, but water will do a pinch. Oh, I do have lightning. Yay! Good. So bad. I did it? Really? Maybe you did. Or maybe some nosy friends of ours decided we needed their help. Is that so? So they saved me once again. Lawn, rain. That's right. We take care of our friends. I don't know if I should be doing all of this right away or if I should be wandering around trying to look for mirages. Um, I'm it, taking a break now. It's not really clear. What now? Who's so... Okay, um, uh, ba -da -ba -da -ba -da. let's go with Figaro. Another wave. Magna rotors, six o'clock. Approaching at speed. Distance, point eight clicks. Baby, directly behind you. 800 out. <sighs> Good job, BB. All targets down. Not a direct hit this time, but the blast was enough. We can't keep doing this forever. If I may, sir, there must be a mobile command center, a cognat that tells the others what to do. If we can locate that and destroy it. Command center? There is that cognat we've been trying to pin down. But you've heard the same reports as I have. Not even the Black Mage's magic was able to put a dent in it. Even if we found it, how are we supposed to stop it? If only we could use machines. Fight fire with fire like Rain and Lawn did. 
fight fire with fire. I think I know someone who can help. Tara! What is it? I heard that you wished to speak to me? Allow me to get directly to the point. That Magitek armor of yours, can it damage the Cogna's mobile command center? The one in the desert? I suppose it might be possible. Edgar, they're staring. Oh, my apologies. <laughs> I couldn't help but be captivated by your beauty. Tell me, did it hurt when you fell from heaven? Oh god, Again. Edgar. Really? Hmm? <laughs> oh, you're playing hard to get, I see. <sighs> so back to the subject at hand. Is it possible or no? My Magitek armor, I summoned it just like a mirage. So I imagine it must be similar to the Cogna. If so, logically speaking, it should be able to hold its own against them. But I wasn't myself when I used it. Saguaritus was controlling me. Say no more, I understand. Forgive me for opening up old wounds like that. Shame on me. But then, of course, my lady is free to inflict a few wounds of her own, now that she has laid my heart bare. Okay, so what do we do about the Cogna? Should we get Rain and Lawn after all? <sighs> Good question. Rain. Lawn. Right. I never did get a chance to repay them. But I can help them now. All right. I'll do it. Oh no, this is th this is just minigame central, isn't it? Oh god. Okay, it says skip past the minigame, and I am going to make an attempt at this. I don't know what this is gonna do. I don't wanna play the dang minigame. I don't like it. Well, I hope I'm at least saving them a little trouble. Good job, Tara. Good job. <laughs> Apparently, you do not have to play their little mini games. Um, I'm not against that. I don't like it. Hello. I've never what been now? good at mini games. Unfortunately, Who's that's just. you touch? That's just the way things are for me, so the fact that they let you skip it is very nice. Um, yeah, let's go to Nibelheim. Whoa! That's how me? Don't know. After we hit 20, I stopped counting. At least, we're wearing it down. You can tell yourself that. It's exactly as I thought. I've been keeping an eye on its behavioral patterns, and it seems to keep moving between the fire valleys. Then you were right. It must be drawn to heat sources. Hmm. Luckily, at least we know now that it shouldn't be coming for Nibelheim anytime soon. But remember Valley 7. There's always a chance one of the fire valleys can go out. If it does, and that thing's near Nibelheim, it might take what it can get. If it's alive, it can die. So let's hit it till it does. As many times as it takes. Okay. Yeah. This will be good training. I'll help in any way I can. Right. Let's go. I like Cloud's philosophy on that. Hit it till it dies. What are we up against? I don't know, but everything from its HP to its um everything is the right of the scale! Have we even got a shot at this thing? Fortunately, it seems like its healing abilities are the limited. So then, we shouldn't expect to take it down in one shot. Huh? Wait, what do you mean? I mean, we fight it as many times as it takes. Dude, that means we have to live through the first time. Oh my. <laughs> I like that super ultima weapon. Nice. Not weak to elements. 
Oh, goody. Does that mean I won't hit it with... Holy, it's purple. That did nothing. Okay. Fine. Hit it until it dies. Does a little bit more. Thunder certainly isn't helping much. Faster. The battle continues. <laughs> okay. Well. If the battle continues, then I suppose we'll have to stay tuned for the next battle. I'll see you guys then. Bye.